Hello, um, so there are a few things I'd like to address in this video. Um, people wonder, first, people wonder, people ask, if, 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 if you, if you're pro-choice, and I am pro-choice, why don't you vote for the Democrats, because they're the party that supports Roe v. Wade. They're the party that, that is pro-abortion. Well, they don't support Roe v. Wade, because they, they allowed the Supreme Court to, the Republicans to overthrow, to, to, to dominate the Supreme Court so that they could overturn Roe v. Wade. Um, and the Democrats, even in Texas, there was a, the Texas primary, um, they allowed Henry Cuellar, who is a, a pro-life Democrat who is against Roe v. Wade, to, to beat Jessica Ch Chisneros. They, they, Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer, they all got together to keep her from winning, and she is pro-choice. And I'm supposed to believe that the Democrats support Ro Roe v. Wade? Uh, anyway, give me a break. Um, the, the second thing I'd like to address um, which, which people will have quite, which some people wonder about is why, why the Republic, the, the Democrat just, or why are the Democrats so weak? Why did they just allow the Republicans to take control of everything? Um, I, I think, I think, um, I, I think there's a reason for why. Um, the reason why is because, um, the de the de fact of the matter is, um, now that Roe v. Wade has been overturned, um, the Democrats they hope to galvanize support so that that people vote for them in 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 twenty twenty two, because they're worried that they're going to lose the House and the Senate and twenty to the Republicans in twenty twenty two. So they need something to galvanize voters, um, so so that they can scam them into fundraising for them. Uh, thinking that they're going to actually do something about abortion rights. Um, and the other, th the other, th the other thing is, um, that the Democrats, they want to be able to keep the house and the Senate. So that way they'll ha they'll be able to, to, to stay in power so that they can pursue regime change in Russia and China. Um, I mean that the Democrats, they're beholden to the, the, FBI and the CIA and those, those those state departments they want regime change in those countries um, and personally I don't think that's a good idea uh, now the other now the, the Republicans they I'm not saying that that the Republicans aren't uh, imperialistic but they're beholden to the Pentagon and the Pentagon is is smarter is smarter to realize is, is smart they realize that regime change in russia and china are not a good idea so um the democrats they're, they're they want to be able to still pursue regime change in in russia and china and that's why they're using roe v wade um as something to galvanize voters into voting for them so that they remain in the house controlling the house and the senate in in after the midterm elections. So there you have it.